you, Tycho Brahe. We've come to see it your way. Instead of seeking E.T., from the Father we will learn. We know Christ has all power. He rules all things this hour. It's the Holy Ghost, not gravity, who makes the heavens turn. Our eyes do show us clearly that the heavens proceed yearly as they are turning daily about our solid earth. The sun and the moon have reasons. They mark the times and seasons. They function as a calendar, which is their very worth. So, thank you, Tycho Brahe. We've come to see it your way. Instead of seeking E.T., from the Father we will learn. We know Christ has all power. He rules the earth this hour. It's the Holy Ghost, not gravity, who makes the heavens turn. Old Galileo's dreaming was humanistic scheming with Copernicus and Kepler who idolized the sun. Their theories lack persuasion against pure observation. When facts replace their fantasy, real science has begun. So, thank you, Tycho Brahe. We've come to see it your way. Instead of seeking E.T., from the Father we will learn. We know Christ has all power. He rules the earth this hour. It's the Holy Ghost, not gravity, who makes the heavens turn. We won't rush to be disputing with the famous Isaac Newton, but his useful calculations are treated as if laws. We agree that unseen forces hold planets in their courses. We call it active providence, so God gets our applause. And thank you, Tycho Brahe, we've come to see it your way. Instead of seeking E.T., from the Father we will learn. We know Christ has all power, He rules the earth this hour. It's the Holy Ghost, not gravity, who makes the heavens turn. Now men like Carl Sagan are ever more so pagan. Trusting chance mutations, saying earth is lost in space. But when we read the Holy Scripture, it requires a different picture. For the earth is terra firma, while the sun runs in a race. Thank you, Tycho Brahe, we've come to see it your way. Instead of seeking E.T., from the Father we will learn. We know Christ has all power, He rules the earth this hour. It's the Holy Ghost, not gravity, who makes the heavens turn.